bam peeps let's take a look at our portfolio see what we got all right guys so today amc is finally crashing a little bit guys so our portfolio is coming back up a little bit all right so we're going to talk about a couple of things today first off let's take a quick look at amc guys this uh, contract on top that you see on the very very top is expiring this friday a bunch of my contracts are expiring this um this one this friday and a bunch next week next friday let's look at amc amc guys is currently going down it's uh, trading at 45.50 cents um I gotta get rid of the contract from that it's gonna expire Friday and then the ones from next week so what I'm really really hoping for guys is that AMC as soon as it hits under 45 I'm getting rid of all the contracts from next week and I'm really hoping that AMC keeps crashing today that it keeps crashing we need to get down below 40s because this is just insane and nonsense insane and nonsense and anyways put down in the comments what your what's your um what's your say on AMC what do you guys think is happening um and after this guys i think i'm gonna leave amc alone for a while because i just took a kaboom on it man you gotta say what it is i took a kaboom on it stocks wise guys i'm doing really good all my stocks are up as you guys can see coinbase guys on average i'm up about 16 percent total return i'm up a hundred dollars on it my latest kind of bought was DraftKings, and i'm doing really good on DraftKings. i'm up 16 percent total on it up 83 dollars Robinhood, which I bought on IPO, IPO pricing, so I got it at 30, well actually I brought it my average cost down because it crashed the first day, so I got it at an average cost of $36, I'm up 26% on it, 26% doing awesome on it, so all my stocks are doing really good, Krispy Kreme, same thing, Krispy Kreme guys, I decided to buy it, I'm up within two weeks, I, bought, I didn't even buy Krispy Kreme two, two weeks ago, and it's we're up 26% on it. So all my stocks really really good guys and today I bought I did not buy it guys through Robinhood because I'm going to show you guys my account is restricted from purchasing because I was day trading too much um but I bought this morning because Kathy Wood just did Zoom went through a huge crash I'm going to show you guys and I bought it on Webull I'm not going to be able to show you guys because as long as I got to exit this but Zoom crashed yesterday like a huge crash you see it right here it crashed it went from three uh 295 no from 348 from, from to lower 300 so from 350 dollars guys yesterday yesterday this was all yesterday in one day it just crashed to under 300 dollars so this morning i bought one share i was gonna buy two share and then i couldn't figure things out on weeble because i'm not i'm new to weeble and I couldn't do the fraction shares. I don't know why it wouldn't work. Um, so I bought one share and I'm probably gonna buy a second share. I'm kind of hoping that the price goes back down to what I bought it compared to the share that I bought. And I'll buy a second share and I'll keep you guys updated on Zoom. The reason why I bought it is because just this past week, if you look, it's down 16%. So I'm hoping to ride the wave. And as you guys can see, it's already up 2% today, one and a half. And Kathy Wood just dropped. If you guys look at the news, Kathy Wood, wood from uh arc investment she bought i think 50 yeah 56 million dollars in zoom shares so i would say probably a good idea and if you look at the 20 an analyst ratings 50 percent buy 46 percent hold only four percent sell so i think it's a good idea i'm gonna buy a second share of this today this is more like sure things um and i'm gonna start being a little more careful with the contracts guys that i took because i kind of took a weapon on them certain contracts that did really good and then like all these amc contracts it's a disaster now guys cryptos are doing really good ethereum let's take a look it's peaking guys it is currently ethereum is trading at 3600 it is spiking it's going through a big big spike today um i mean just today it's up to over 200 dollars. so it was under 34 now we're up over 3600 good stuff man good stuff good stuff dogecoin is coming back up 28 cents it's not it's not going up enough though dogecoin needs to stabilize up there there's articles that just came out actually today let me show you guys about uh dogecoin hitting a dollar where did i see these article i think it was on weeble maybe it would have been on, it, it was on weeble and guys bitcoin is almost at 48 i think did it hit 48 this morning almost 47 900 so it almost got there and it's like it's trying it's trying to get there guys it's trying to get the forty-eight thousand. 
There it is, guys. On screen, boom, 48,000. Beautiful, beautiful. We need the Bitcoin to stay up over 48,000 and we'll be good. We'll be good, good, good. Newswise, Twitter test tips with Bitcoin, how BTC adoption could be parabolic. It could be for Bitcoin major, it could be major. Uh, here you go guys you see the article is ethereum rally sig signaling uh the next bull market face for bitcoin above 50. if you if you look overall ethereum going up six percent dogecoin two percent litcoin three percent bitcoin is about to probably hit 50. probably if uh ethereum doesn't drop below 3500 i think below um bitcoin belongs at 50,000. and anyways that's for all my portfolio guys a little bit random uh news update and guys let me know what you guys would do with the option on AMC. If it was in your hands, what you guys would do. I'm out. I'm going to keep this short. Make sure you are subscribed to the channel, guys, to follow through our daily videos and our daily updates. And we're going to keep doing what we're doing, guys. I'm out. Have an awesome day. Happy investing, guys. Bye.